Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's going to be up high. I just don't know exactly where. 10 4, good copy. So they probably dropped it up on top somewhere. Their assignment hunt for narcotics in this rugged desert stretch. We got more agents on scene, area's been secured. We're gonna go look for these bundles. And find the drugs before the cartel can reclaim them. They'll come back for this. This is what they do for a living. This is how they get paid. Agent Philip Price and his team stay on high alert as they begin their search. And they'll even watch us from a distance. They'll watch us the whole time. And I wouldn't be surprised if they're watching us right now. Keep your eyes open, bro. We're gonna get a little closer and check it out. I mean, the dope may be right here. A border patrol team scours Oregon Pipe National Park. The drugs could be hidden anywhere in these hills. Hey, you guys find something up there? What do you got? Agent Philip Price and his team split up to cover more ground. We got some pretty good sign heading this way. See we can find any bundles. We worked the areas enough, we learned their traffic patterns. It's like an Easter egg hunt. Except these guys might kill you if you find their eggs. Price looks for clues, such as missing branches and misplaced stones. See how they pulled out the rocks here. As you we walk around here, see they pulled out the rocks cover up their bundle. If you look over there, you're going to see some unnatural rocks right up against the bush. Rocks don't grow like that. There's one. This one's just not. Two. See the bundle, you can smell it. Bundle threes. The more and more you catch them, the harder they try and make it. You know, use the local brush and stuff to cover it up. It's supposed to make it harder for us to find it. After a two hour search, agents recover four bundles. There may be more, but Price and his team must move on to the next case. After a while, these guys get really good at the game of hiding, hiding these things. More than once, bundles have been left behind. It's just how it goes. It's, you can't get it all, but if we get the majority of it, it makes a difference. It's gonna go to the streets, and the money that they get off of this stuff, you know, should be going to fund more drug smuggling, smuggling of aliens, who knows? The seizure is just a fraction of the 100 tons of marijuana estimated to come through the park each year. You never know, there, there could be dope all in these hills, up in those mountains out there. I mean, this is a funnel for these guys. They come straight through here, head to the highway. Dope everywhere out here right now.